Hi. New Year may see serious revelations due to a judge ordering certain court documents concerning Jeffrey Epstein, his victims, certain perpetrators, to be named. This will undoubtedly unleash a tsunami of scandal involving top figures in the worlds of government, entertainment, finance. More information about the doings of Prince Andrew will certainly hit the headlines. It will result in more trafficking victims coming forth with explosive revelations. None of this should be regarded as lurid tittle-tattle. It goes to the very top of the world's ruling class, the elites, their insatiable appetite for the physical abuse of the lower orders, also their barefaced effrontery as they continue moralising about the behaviour of the plebs. What makes this doubly nauseating is, as we well know, the victims were underage girls. Among a substantial section of the rich and powerful, this is regarded as normal. How indeed they are different from the rest of us, usually a phrase employed by the capped off us, but has a far different meaning with many of us, most of it not pleasant. Let's hope the Western, or at least the North American elites, are thrown into an unwelcome spotlight. The likes of Trump, the Clintons, other luminaries were all visitors to Epstein's Pedo Island, honoured guests, lacking so far a serious movement from below that can actually threaten and bring down this pestilential parasitic glass. We can only await the New Year's revelations and regard them as part of our ongoing education into the doings, motivations of the ruling classes and the elites. So don't ignore these imminent headlines. Learn, absorb, be angry, start doing something about it. Starting here with Prince Andrew and his enabler brother King Charles III, the rest of the royals, who so far have had most of their secrets skirted about or simply covered up by complicit media, civil service, politicians. Let the dominoes start falling here and worldwide. Bye.